Unmute yourself. You see the point. Uh, oh, unmute. Uh, is it not? Oh, just a second. Is it okay now? <clears throat> yeah, absolutely. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, Vineet. Uh, thank you for calling for this explosive discussion. This is something which is actually haunting and intimidating every citizen of this country. The way uh, opposition has resorted to filibustering. Actually, it is not a very constructive filibustering. It is a practically damaging, sabotaging the most fundamental elements of Indian constitution sabotaging the democracy of this country through this parliament. They were the people who said no parliament should run from the roads. They opposed Kejriwal's Lokdar bill that you should not come to the road. Roads will not make the legislation. It's the parliament which has the exclusive property of making the legislation. They are absolutely taking U-turn. It's completely like a chaotic politics which Congress is resorting to. They are, they are, they are trying to be very symbolic. You know, they are very selective. Sometimes Mr. Rahul Gandhi will become very, very active. Suddenly, on a very explosive issues on a farm matters, he will disappear to the foreign joints. So, you know, there is a huge amount of contradiction. In 2003, you have seen the way their own colleagues have been uh, um, investigated and, uh, and the snooping was done, including uh, Pranam Mukherjee, the former president of India. So, you know, these guys have a, so much of a skeleton, so much of a skeleton, they have no moral authority. and. Let me tell you what is wrong with the uh, with the with the NDA right now. They are letting the parliament to happen. The minister made a statement, Suomoto, uh, that uh, on 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 uh, 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 Pegasus uh, snow gate, and then that was the time when opposition could have taken this plan and continue the debate. They are not interested in debate. They are just interested because somehow they are not able to hold Mr. Modi's popularity. He is being uh, voted by the international institutions as one of the most popular prime ministers in the world. So, I mean, these guys are, have lost out each and every possibility to to obstruct Mr. Modi's popularity and his democratic popularity. They are, they are resorting to, they are not bothered to attend when the third wave meeting prime minister had called. These people did not turn up. Mamta Banerjee does, does not turn up. Uh, Kejriwal does not turn up. Now these guys are suddenly coming together because even their collective strength is so minuscule in front of Mr. Modi. It, it is so transparent. I am surprised. People are going to punish them for wasting 133 crores of Indian, uh, the taxpayers' money. The only 14% Lok Sabha and about 16% is Rajya Sabha. Okay, one second. Alright, Tasi,